All right, so this laptop was missing the rubber feet. It only has one. So I found this nice um, alternative. Instead of replacing the rubber feet, I found this where, um, I don't know, the as you can see, the writing is all typoed, <laughs> messed up, but it's made of metal. So let's go ahead and open it and see what we got. <clears throat> all right, so that's interesting. So it comes like this. These feet are already rubber and grippy as well as the bottom here, but it also came with these little rubber circles. So I'm guessing that if you want, you can put them on the front here and that will prevent it from slipping because it's going to raise the laptop up at an angle. So let me go ahead and pull these out and then we'll see. All right, so just take them out. I'm going to push them out just like this. So here you can see, oh, it has, what is that? Is that that's not a magnet, is it? No. So... I guess it comes with extra adhesives in case you mess up or something or you need to move it to a new one. That's really nice. So, And then it has a set that's already attached here. So basically what you'll do is these will stick on here. Okay, just like this, bottom feet. Um, you'll peel off this layer, of course. I'm going to have to test it real quick to see what position I like and then we'll stick it on. All right, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so we're going to stick it on like this, all right? You don't want to stick it too close to the edge because it's rounded there. It varies from model to model of laptop, of course. Let's go ahead and peel off this protective sticker coating, okay? All right, just peel it up like this. All right, so under here you can see this is um, basically permanent uh, outdoor, what do you call, adhesive double stick mounting tape. So I actually have this kind of stuff and this kind of mounting tape holds on very strong. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try and line this up to be lined up with the circle here. So when it's completely opened, it's kind of uh, lined up there. So this edge will actually be slightly lower. Sorry, I know it's focusing on my hand and not on the computer, but it is what it is. So let's go ahead and get this lined up. Okay, again, this stuff sticks down real strong, so make sure you get it right with, before putting too much pressure down on it. I kind of like everything being completely leveled, centered, kind of, so it's kind of tough for me to make sure. But there we go. Okay, so we got that. It's probably slightly off, but it is what it is. I already peeled it off. Let's go ahead and do the other side. Okay. Same thing. Peel this up. Okay, again, it's nice that they give another piece just in case you screw it up. Okay. I'm gonna line this up just like the other one. And we're just gonna drop it down, of course. Okay, so we got that. Now you can see we got these little feet here. That stick like that. I'm gonna show you. We're gonna turn the laptop over and I'll be back. Okay, so now we got the laptop like this and here you can see it's raised up. If you don't like it raised up, you could always fold those down and then it sits like that. So it's kind of nice. It does grip to the table well. If I need, I'll end up putting these little rubber circles as well, but most likely I won't need it because two should be okay. Um, but we'll see. Worst case, we'll just add these little rubber feet. I might end up using all four so that it kind of has more even pressure across the bottom. But again, that's pretty much it. So it's nice. Um, it's very thin when it's closed. So when you put it, if you have a laptop bag or something, it's not going to really take too much extra space. As you can see, there's this rubber piece already here and it's not too much taller. It's maybe a double that. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Hopefully this video will help you guys with, um, if you have these missing rubber feet, it'll be a better idea. Um, it also holds it at a nicer angle for typing on. Yep, I'll see you guys later. I put a link in the description below if you're interested. Um, that was the cheapest one I found and they seem to be nice and sturdy. Alright, see you guys later. Bye.